Good afternoon and happy Wednesday to all of your sunshiny faces. I was thinking tomorrow was Friday, guys. I have somewhere I have to go tomorrow, which is Thursday, but for some reason I was thinking it was on Friday, so I was thinking today was Thursday. Now it's still only Wednesday, which I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. I feel like I've gotten a lot accomplished so far for it only being Wednesday of this week, so um yeah, I don't like it's I don't think it's a bad thing that it feels like it's only, or it is only Wednesday, but it feels like it's later in the week. Um, but guys, I still need to get some laundry done, but I don't know if I told you guys, Bliss actually yesterday ended up getting into the dog food and she, um, ended up having diarrhea on the kitchen floor because she ate like a lot of dog food. Um, and so she obviously had an upset stomach. Whenever the dog poos in the house or has an accident or something like that, which like, okay, I blame her for getting into the dog food. She knows better. She sneaks in there and gets it. Um, like if somebody forgets to leave the door open or forgets and leaves the door open, she's really smart about knowing when to go in there and when to go and get the food. Like she waits till nobody else is around and I'm telling you guys, this dog could be like a spy or something like that. <laughs> like she's so smart, you know, she'll, like I said, she'll n realize that like the door in the laundry room has been left open by somebody, even if it's just a little bit. And sometimes she even goes and she tests it. So she'll like, you know, nudge on the door and see that it's open and then she'll go walk away and like go lay in the living room or something like that and then once everybody goes to bed or everybody leaves or something like that she sneaks in the laundry room and then goes in there and eats the dog food um and like I mean rarely does it ever happen that somebody leaves the door open but I really think that yesterday was Matthew that left the door open because before he went to bed or before I went to bed on I think it was Monday night I heard him go into the laundry room and I was like it sounds like he didn't close the door and I was like I really hope that he either realized he didn't close it maybe I just didn't hear it correctly or because the door's right on the other side of my wall um and or he just keeps Bliss upstairs and she doesn't get into it sure enough I woke up in the morning and she was you know um six so she never threw up which normally she winds up throwing up so i guess that was kind of good but um yeah so she ended up like i said having diarrhea on the floor which i don't it, it's her fault for eating the food when she knows she's not supposed to but um you know she ended up having an accident on the floor okay we clean it up the problem is is that she gets so freaked out because she's went to she's so such a well-trained dog that if she has an accident in the house like something that she literally just can't control um then she winds up freaking herself out and pees on top of it only does she have a number two accident on the floor well she also has a number one accident on the floor which i personally think is harder to clean up the latter of the two is the smellier one but i think that the other one is just harder to clean up. I don't like cleaning that up. Um, I don't like cleaning either of them up. But she just gets herself so freaked out that she winds up like peeing on the floor. But the problem was that she ended up peeing on her bed. So that's why I just like don't even want to deal with <laughs> cleaning that up too. That's not my responsibility. It shouldn't have been my responsibility to clean any of it up. But since I was I think the only one here at the time, um, I ended up just you know, like I said, just taking care of what I need to take care of. Um, and so, yeah, I don't know who's taking care of that or what's happening. But the problem is it's sitting in the slop tub right now. So I can't do laundry because there's a dog bed that is sitting in the slop tub, which is how the water drains from the washing machine. So I've been waiting to do laundry. I also needed to kind of need to do dishes, but I did make dinner for tonight. Um, and then I also edited three vlogs today. I wanted to get to four, but my Mac was dying and I was actually into the extra innings of the Cubs game. And so I was like, oh, like I'll watch the, the extra innings of the Cubs game while we're, you know, while I finish editing another two. And then my Mac was almost dead and I only got to an extra one because I finished the first two and was doing another one. Um, and I didn't have enough time to finish that one. So, um, or I finished that one and didn't have enough time to do start another one. So I'm at my weird uneven number, which I don't like being at. Tomorrow, though, I do have to run the errand like I told you guys, too. And then on top of that, me and my mom actually did try and go to the farmer's market this morning. It doesn't start until June, guys, which is really frustrating because I pulled it up 
um, just like in Google and it had like first in Google it was like open from 10 a.m. until 1 or whatever um, or 7 a.m. I think until 1 and my mom said that she had seen a sign and um, so we were looking it up and I was like it says it's open and I was like clearly it's not open because we drove through and it was in the same spot it said it was supposed to be at but then I looked and it actually said from June I think until like August or something like that and my mom's like but I saw a sign and I was like I thought I did too I actually I don't know if I saw the sign but I saw something somewhere like an advertisement for it or something like that and so yeah I was kind of frustrated too so we ended up actually just stopping at Dunkin Donuts and got munchkins and bagels and my mom got coffee um so we were supposed to get um <laughs> fresh fresh produce I ended up with a um veggie cream cheese on my bagel so um <laughs> it wasn't really the same but then Friday guys though here's the thing I wanted to actually try and get into the yard and like do some yard work but it's supposed to thunderstorm tomorrow through Sunday and then I have my cousin's wedding is on Saturday so there's like a lot of stuff going on this weekend but on top of that too I don't think I'll be able to get into the garden for a few more days which is finally getting warm guys it's like 70s and stuff like that I think it's supposed to be like 70s 80s and everything but it's supposed to thunderstorm so I'm like great now that we have warm weather I still can't be outside because it's thunderstorming and raining outside so oh yeah this entire weekend is gonna stink and I don't think we're gonna be able to get anything done outside but one of the things that we could get done which I'd be very excited to try and start on or do is maybe actually do some more like attic organization because it's still to the point where it's cool enough out right now where it's not because our attic isn't like you know insulate I mean it's insulated but it's not like heated or you know there's no cooling or anything like that in there so in the winters it's kind of cold and in the summers it's pretty hot so right now would kind of be that perfect like in between like it's not like 80s 90s out it's like 60s 70s um so it's still gonna be kind of warm up there but not too ridiculously hot where we're feeling like you know it's like I mean if it's like 90 degrees that's probably hotter in the attic because there's really no like you know breeze or anything like that coming through there I mean there's a window but I don't know how how well <laughs> it's really gonna wind up working or anything like that so um yeah we uh might try and maybe I was thinking about that I was like well what other projects can I do if it's not um like you know if it's raining outside I can't do anything outside and I was thinking like oh that's one of them I also need to reorganize the laundry room um and like get our like we're gonna do other shelves and like we just need more storage in the laundry room and there's space for it it's just finding it kind of and like utilizing some more of the wall space and everything but I'm not gonna do anything in the laundry room until that dog bed is taken care of <laughs> anyways though I'll see you guys all in tomorrow's vlog if you guys did enjoy today so make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and I'll see y'all for some shiny faces tomorrow so bye guys